So we know that these anabolic drugs, which stimulate bone formation, cause bone to grow and bone mass to increase, strengthen bone quickly and very prominently. And in fact, uh, these drugs have been shown in multiple trials to reduce the risk of fractures more and faster than our anti-resorptive drugs. So for people who are really at high risk for fracture, you want to use the, the best drug that's going to offer them the, the greatest chance of preventing more fractures, which are associated with disability and ultimately uh, pain, deformity, loss of independence, and all of the complications of osteoporosis. Using these anabolic agents as first-line therapy is the way that, that all of the clinical trials have been done. And we know that when we, we reserve these for people who've already been on many other therapies, the effects may not be as good, and we don't have the fracture data. We know, for example, that bone density in the hip declines when you switch from one of these potent drugs, uh, a bisphosphonate or a denosumab, uh, to a drug like teriparatide. Uh, bone density declines. That's not what you want in a person who's at high risk for fracture. Uh, using that drug first uh, is going to provide the benefit against both vertebral and non-vertebral fractures. Using it second, we have less uh, information about. It's certainly suboptimal. Patients who have fractures have a lot of concerns. Uh, hip fracture patients, you know, they're worried about just whether they can walk to the bathroom. Uh, but uh, many uh, younger patients, uh, particularly uh, women who have wrist fractures, humerus fractures, uh, more minor fractures, uh, as, as we sometimes say, uh, if we were to uh, make sure to target them for, with the most uh, potent therapies, uh, we could probably prevent a lot of these hip fractures. That's what I'm really interested in doing. I want to get the, the people when they're a little younger, having their first fracture or presenting as a high risk uh, patient, uh, treat them with the most effective medicines we've got, uh, and know that I'm preventing fractures uh, for them in the long term. I think that's a great use uh, of anabolic therapy.